So, without further ado, we will start the show with the amazing and talented Rosetta and Evelyn, joined by Ali Deneen. She's going to play right after us at 2.30 um, with Farrell Foster, and it's going to be really awesome. Um, that song was Trouble in Mind. We played the Roscoe Holcomb version. Um, there's a bunch of versions of that song. People play it a lot of different ways. There's like Nina Simone sings it. Uh, it's like an old blues song. It's really awesome. Uh, the next song is going to be Wildwood Flower. Uh, it was a Carter family song that was originally recorded in 1860 uh, with a song called Twine Mid the Ringlets. Uh, they changed it a little, made it more their own version, and we're going to sing that version of the song. Um, we're super excited to be here at the Americana Fest. Um, we want to thank Karen and Jen Bell, and yeah, we're super excited to play this next tune. <laughs> Takes a lot to tune from F to D. Uh, we're, we're, yeah. No, almost ready. <laughs> it takes a lot. <laughs> um, we're, the Carter family is an awesome, uh, they sang a bunch of cool tunes. Um, yeah, we're going to sing here. I think this is the only song we're singing for the Carter family, but we've sang a couple together previously. That was really awesome. All right, are you ready? Yes. Awesome. <laughs>
Williams song. It's called Set. It's called Set in the Woods on Fire. Um, we're both playing multiple instruments in the set. Ooh. <laughs> um, I learned this song a while ago uh, with our banjo teacher, uh, Hillary Hawk. Um, she'll be playing later today too at the seven with the wild, wild goats. Um, uh, oh, um, uh, I actually learned this song from Rosetta. Um, we both have the same teacher, but I never got a chance to learn it, and I'm really glad that we did. Good. I got a chance to learn it. It's a great song. Awesome. Okay. Comb your hair and paint it powder. You act proud, I'll act prouder. You sing loud, I'll sing louder. Night birds set in the woods on fire. You're my gal and I'm your feller. Dress up in your frock of yellow. You act swell, I'll act sweller. Set the woods on fire. Spotted Pony. Um, we have a little round to do it in. Um, and it's, yeah, we like playing it together. This is like the one song we could get on the first try, which is awesome. Do you have the arrangement? It's here. Okay. It's so confusing that we need to look at it on a sheet of paper. Um, okay. Start. I'm almost ready. There's a bunch of different banjo tunings, so we're going to have to go through all of them. Um, <laughs> our banjo teacher, Hilary Hawk, taught me this song, and I thought it would be really fun to do um, it in a round, and actually, my friend taught me this round, which is... I wanted, yeah, I wanted to play more banjo, so we were like, okay, let's do the song together. It's like a little dueling banjo song. That song, Trouble in Mind, that we sang, um, we actually wrote the harmonies for it. Um, and we really were enjoying writing harmonies together. Um, uh, our banjo teacher helped us a little for Wildwood Flower, but for most of the songs we harmonize on, we wrote the harmonies, which is awesome.
another Hank Williams song. Um, it's like one of the only songs he sang in a minor key. It's called Ramblin' Man. It's one of his most famous. Um, Abby's gonna sing it. It's gonna be really awesome. <laughs> I need to tune. <laughs> Most of what we've been doing is tuning. Um, the Allie who sang, who played Trouble in Mind with us, um, she taught me the vocal part for this song. And um, yeah, she's an amazing singer. I don't know why we didn't have her sing with us for Trouble in Mind, but we didn't. And uh, she's playing right after us, which you should stay and see her because she's amazing. She's playing with Farrell Foster. I think we already said that, but she's amazing. <laughs> the flop eared mule thing. But our banjo teacher, Hillary Hawk, taught us this song. Um, and she helped us write a banjo harmony for it. Because um, we thought, like, well, if we're just both playing the same thing on the same instrument for a while, it might get a little boring. Um, it was fun to, like, learn it together and be able to play it together. Um, we've been, the song might be, like, one of the hardest things I've learned on the banjo because it's like, goes really fast and starts really high. Um, yeah, this is, this is Flop Your Mule. Yes, almost. <laughs> Still tuning.
We have one more song. Um, I heard this one from Rian and Giddens, but Rosetta actually heard this one um, from Elizabeth Cotton. YouTube video. Yeah. yeah. Um, Elizabeth Cotton, I think, is really cool. Uh, she played the banjo when she was really young, when she was like me and Abby's age. Um, and then she like didn't do it anymore. Uh, but then she was a maid for the Seegers. Um, she was able to pick up playing music again. This song was actually recorded or like put out into the world when she was 73 years old. Um, I can't play the guitar like Elizabeth Cotton because she played it backwards. Um, but we like to have our own little arrangement of it. Wait, can I? I just read to It's really, it's okay. very out of tune. We're out of tune. Um, but, so yeah, I think she's really cool. There's a really cool video on the internet of um, an interview with her and Pete Seeger, and she just talks about how she grew up, not grew up, but worked in his household. Um, she's just such a cool woman. I think she, she wrote Freight Train, which is an awesome song, when she was like 16 years old or something like that, um, which is super awesome, super cool and inspiring. Okay, now, <laughs> now we're going to play it.
All right, let's give them a big round. Come on, everybody.